Hello folks, it's Kane and welcome to Kane's Corner. We're playing more Mass Effect 2, Infiltrator Insanity, and we are going to go and do the Overlord DLC now, which um, I should warn people about. I like this. It is incredibly well written. However, it may be a little bit disturbing for anyone with potential mental health problems and or autism. I want to make that clear. It's a very heavy story. Okay? So, if you end up wanting to skip these two parts, I totally, totally understand. I just want to make that clear. It is essentially a content warning. Okay? Now that's done, let's crack on. You'll see why. But it's very heavy. Right, now I remember that this has a lot of combat, so I'm going to take these two. Uh, we're all good there, we're all good there, and we're all good there. And this is why I said I needed the hammerhead. Okay, retract dish. My name is Dr. Gavin Archer. The situation is urgent. We're facing a catastrophic VI breakout. I'll explain the details later, but you must retract that transmission dish. The we can do that. Your position. You have to hurry. All right, so we don't go in there. We go down here. Over here. On the monitor. Yep, I see you. Yeah, we'll be fine. Don't worry. Right, nothing there. This is a secure facility. All weapons must be declared upon entry and checked with security personnel on duty. Uh, how about no? Fuck you. Keep my gun. Just checking to make sure there's nothing to loot, which there is not. Okay. Hello. Access denied. Doors secured from the inside. Hmm, okay. Right, through here then. I probably should have brought Miranda and Jacob, actually. Right, retract dish. Listen to the log first. Memo to all project personnel. I understand there's some concern about handling life, Geth. I agree it's a risk, but the potential reward is far greater. Someday your sons and daughters will thank you. Huh. Sounds like uh, Tally's dad. Maybe I should have brought her instead, eh? Okay, I can do that. Could have sworn I was being watched then. Okie dokie, sit so down here. PDA, there. This is an automated security update. Get activity has been detected. Please no shit. Oh crap, hello. Oh, you're not a normal guest, are you? Okay, that's that sorted, and then we need to deal with that destroyer. Actually, I'll get the trooper first because they're easier to kill and it just reduces the amount of incoming fire, so it makes logical sense, I think. Right, give me some ammo then. Crap, there's more gas there. Hide here. Shoot that one. 
I'm not too sure about the uh, get lunch ladies. Just saying. Or is it lunch persons now? I'm not sure. Please feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. There we go. No, don't even try it. Okay. Give me that ammo. There's some more over here, so I'll grab this. There's a door up there I'd like to go and investigate, but uh, I have suspicion I need to go through here. Lock and load. Oh, look, Geth. Go. There we go, just spin him out a bit. Fuck off with that flamethrower. Ooh, funds. Yoink. Shepard just stealing the fucking spare change out of everything. Give me the power cells. What are you doing? Oh. I see the other gas. Oh, there's a lot of gas. Okay. I am Kroger. Yeah, I definitely should have brought Sally for this, I think. I'm not going to be able to shoot through that. There's glass in the way. They've got They're through my shield. Oh, back up. Back up. We're getting shot to shit. How am I? I'm all right on ammo. I'm all right. Okay, I think that's the way I need to go. So I want to have a very quick look around. Because like I said, there was a door over here. So I would like to investigate this. And just make sure that there's... You know, I'm not missing anything. I think that's reasonable. Log. Welcome to all project personnel. Congratulations on your hard work. Tomorrow we make the next leap forward. It'll be a great day for Cerberus. And an even greater day for humanity. Okay. All right. Let's go through here. And that's the way I've got to go. Right, I'm pretty much full on ammo. I'm missing like one. Oh, never mind. I'm full. Nice music. I'll take that. And that. Well, this must be the tram. Yep, it is. I appear to have left Zaid behind. Mm-hmm. That's normal for Shepard, though. Don't worry about it. Oh, there's Zaid. Hmm. I don't think the VI has a department supervisor or particularly cares. I saw those power cells, but I can't now see them to grab. So that's kind of annoying. Also. This inability to hide is also kind of annoying. Come on, fuck your shields. And then be set on fire. Feel the blood rage. 
Oh, that exploded. Right. What's... Excuse me. What's down here? Power cells. Okay, I'm full on ammo, which is... Uh, grunt, please. Uh, full on ammo, which is surprising. Yes, I know. But I kind of have to be a bit careful so I don't get fucking murdered. Palladium, I'll have that. Medical station, thank you. Now, is there actually like any chance of cover at all? Doesn't look like it. Just gonna hang around with my dick out, apparently. That's a thing. Okay. Hello. I'm absolutely going to get fucking flanked, aren't I? Yep. Run over here. There we go. Hello. Nothing there. Just going to hide for a second. Let my shit regenerate. There we go. That's the one down there. Oh, he pops up. Hello. Goodbye. Nice shot, Grunt. Okay. Bypass this door. So, what we got? That one and that one. That one and that one. That one and that one. And those two. Yeah, that's what I expected. Hello. That's nearly dead. I'm going to pop this. And then set fire to the hunter, please. I'll put them down. This way. Got ya. And got you again. Oh, crap. Hi. That one over that side appears to have moved, so that's fine by me. That's dead. That was terrible. That's a lot of rockets. Saeed's down. I need to swap to this. Reload. Some of that's popped behind me. I need to move. I'm gonna go here. Fuck off! Damn it! I uh, that was that was my own fault. I uh, kind of put myself into a bad situation, and that would have come around the side and shot me. So it was like take the risk. At least the hunter's nearly dead. There we go. Yeah. 
Okay, is that done? Yes. There's one more over this way. Somewhere. There. Right, now we move around. And it should trigger some more to spawn. I'm going to hide here and shoot that. Destroyer has to go. Zaid, why? All right, sort to this. Oh, crap. Damn it. I couldn't get away. That was my own fault for not checking the sides. God damn it. This room is a nightmare. I'll be there. It is a legitimate nightmare, so, you know, I'm kind of not surprised. Oh, Zaid, why? You're not a very good mercenary, Zaid. I want my fucking money back if I hired you. Oh, wait, I did. Well, technically, the elusive man did. So, theoretically, it's not my problem. No spawn? There we go. Oh, that's a bit laggy, isn't it? Get rid of that. Uh, use this. I'm going to swap to that. There we go. Well, I'm going to back up a bit and move here. That's what I thought, you crafty little fuck. Right, there we go. Good. Excellent. Okay. Oh, that's a big boy, that. I'm not okay with that. Oh, that's a really big boy. I'm absolutely not okay with that. Uh, yeah, give myself a second. Let that regenerate. Now pop this. Use that to get away. Ah, oh, I can't see it. It's fucking jammed. That's annoying. There you are. Uh, do that. Oh, crap. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, fuck. Oh, I hate combat drones. Oh, fucking combat drones. Get out of cover. Oh, thanks. You know what? I'm going to swap to this. Trouble. Come on, reach in faster, please. Thank you. Firing at me, idiot. Oh, get out of the way then, twat face. Mm. 
Zaid, like, don't get cocky. You spent most of that fight on the fucking floor, mate. Give me that ammo. Too late. Now you're dead. That don't sound good. I might need to get over here and help. I'm going to back up a bit. Just try and reduce any possible flanking. Now I can risk pushing forwards a little. They got heavy. Feel the blood rage. All right, it is dead. Good. I wasn't sure for a moment. That one is dead as well. That one is not. Now it is. is right, now I need to swap to this and hide. I said hide. Pop that. Come on. Oh, perfect. Do that. Good. No armor for you. And now hopefully no health in very short order. Grun just ate a bag of dicks. Really? Right, I think I've got to go up. I'm just going to have a very quick check. And that's why you check. Attention. Hello, hiding guest. Oh, hey, Zaid. You could have been helpful like five minutes ago, mate. There's ammo there. I'll grab that. Don't see any openable doors or anything like that. There's a bit of ammo there. I don't think I need it, but let's just double check. Nope. All right, so we go up here now. There's got to be more geth up here. That was a lot of fucking geth. That was like an excessive amount of geth. Okay. You need to destroy the support struts now. They have their own capacitors. Try blowing them up. Uh, yeah, I can do that. Right. The VI's not very happy, is it? Alright, you lot have fun with that. Right, do that, swap to this. Hell yeah. Grab the ammo, hit that. That's a couple of destroyers and rocket troopers. Nothing to worry about there then. Oh no, sorry, my mistake. It's a fucking prime. Please, right, use that. And fucking run. Just to give myself some more uh, breathing room. 
So I bloody need it. Uh, set fire to it. Oh crap. I'm about to die. Do that, quick. Okay, right. Uh, grab this. Okay, fucking hell. That was nearly bad. Right. How are we doing? You alright with that, Zaid? Right, this can't actually hit me until it gets close. So... I'm happy to just stay at range and do this. Yeah, that's the problem with the flame flow there, mate. You can't hit me because you're too far away. And now you're dead. Right, I don't see any more geth, so I can run over here now. There's ammo there, which is great because I need it. Do that. Hit that. Back up. I thought I needed to do four of those, not three. Oh, well. Gotta be kidding. Move! The whole thing's giving way! Shep ain't happy. That was impressive for, like, three capacitors. Over here! hell's going on around here? Man's reach exceeding his grasp. Come on, I'll explain. I want to know who that voice actor is. I know he plays one of the Quarians, but I recognize him from somewhere else and I don't know where. Right, transmission is destroyed, surviving sites is located, got XP, got credits, got palladium. Cool. You bought us some time, though probably not much. This isn't over yet. Okay, who are you again? Who did you say you were? Dr. Gavin Archer, chief scientist at this facility, and probably the only one left. Okay, and the situation? You owe us that explanation. This is Project Overlord, an attempt to gain influence over the Geth by interfacing a human mind with a VI. The results have been less than satisfactory. What happened? Where did it go wrong? My brother, David, volunteered to serve as a test subject, but his mind couldn't handle the VI connection. He's like a virus now, infecting our networks and seizing control of any technology he finds. It's why you had to destroy the dish. Imagine if his program got off-world. Infecting? How does he take control of electronics? This is a hybrid intelligence the likes of which I've never seen. I don't know where the man ends and the machine begins. And the consequences? What's the worst case scenario? A technological apocalypse. Every machine, every weapon, every computer could be turned against us. If he hit the extranet, who knows where it would end. And you didn't take precautions? You should have considered that before you started the experiment. We couldn't be expected to account for every outcome. Certainly not the abomination David has become. David, the VI has fortified itself in the main laboratory at Atlas Station. It's in lockdown now. To enter, you need to manually override security from our facilities in the Prometheus and Vulcan stations. Okay, override? How does the lockdown work? It's a fail-safe procedure in the event of an emergency. Normally, all three project leads have to agree to cancel the lockdown. I'm the only one left now. I can give my authorization, but you'll have to manually reset the other two yourself. And what happens if I have to kill your brother? Let's just hope it doesn't come to that. Okay. Project Overlord. Tell me more about Project Overlord. We wanted to turn the guest's religious impulse into a weapon. When we saw them following Saren, we realized they could be swayed. And if a proper figurehead was created, a virus with a face, if you will, the Geth might be controlled. A bold plan? That's an ambitious undertaking. It would be the perfect weapon. Victory without casualties. We could avoid war with the Geth altogether. That was the plan, anyway. 
Okay, the Prometheus and Vulcan stations. Tell me about Vulcan and Prometheus stations. Vulcan station is our geothermal plant. It generates power for the four outposts. Prometheus station is a crashed Geth ship full of dormant machines. We use them for our experiments. Oh dear. This station? What happens on this station? This is Hermes station, our communications uplink with the wider galaxy. If you hadn't destroyed the dish in time, the outcome would have been catastrophic. Okay, and the experiment? What went wrong with the experiment? David volunteered to interface with the VI to give it genuine consciousness. Theoretically, it should have been safe, but with artificial intelligence, there's no such thing as safe. Bad idea. Then you shouldn't have attempted it. And what if you've never attempted to find the Reapers, Commander Shepard? Where would the galaxy be then? Sometimes you have to ignore the risks. In fairness, I didn't attempt to find the Reapers. I was attempting to find Saren, and I happened to find a Reaper. There is a difference. Atlas Station. What can you tell me about Atlas Station? Atlas Station is the main laboratory where all of our VI experiments take place. It's your final goal once you've overridden the lockdown. It's also where my brother became something else. All right. I'm heading out now. The other stations are all within driving distance. Best of luck, Commander. Is there anything in here that is lootable? It looks like the answer to that is no. Okay. Well, there's me thingy. Uh. Yeah. I think we've got time to do one. I think we've got time. My memory is correct. The Geth one's the worst one. And he said that was Prometheus. So we'll try the other one. Commander, you need to find Vulcan and Prometheus stations and override the lockdown from each facility. It doesn't matter which one you hit first, but you can't enter Atlas Station until you've dealt with both. Yeah, also, I know. Keep an eye out for Cerberus security mechs. The VI has likely taken control of them. Archer out. Okay. That looks like where I need to go. Right. So I'm going to probably go do Vulcan first. I mean, it's it's not wrong. That is, that is actually really quite pretty. And it was quite pretty in the Xbox 360 days. Because I originally played this on Xbox 360. And then I got the PC version later. Um... But uh, now it's had a bit of an upgrade. Yeah, it's even nicer, in it? Let's just be honest, eh? I actually have Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3 Collector's Editions on the 360. Sat in my living room. So, yeah, that's how much of a nerd I am. An emergency Cerberus data packet has been recovered. Oh, the six of them. Information on Project Overlord that Ooh. Yeah, all right. I'll definitely keep an eye out for those while I'm flying around. I might actually look at where they are because it could be a bit of a pain in the ass, but I'll definitely get those done. Right. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to take the two Cerberus dickheads. I want to see if there's any different conversation. I don't think there is, but I'm curious. Oh, Max, fantastic. Fucking get right over, nerd. Commander, this is Archer. Right. I advise extreme caution. Vulcan station is our geothermal plant. They stop reporting it shortly after the experiment. Scanning area. Analysis. The eye infection is present within plant machinery. Advise caution. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, I see. I see. Okay, right. So we... You have to time it. Okay. There we are. Like that. Oh, 
Right, back up, back up, back up. A little bit of a regen. Goodbye. What's this way? I thought there was something hiding. Is this one of the data packets? No, it's Iridium. Oh, well. They almost be out in the other area then. That's fine, but I, you know, I think it was worth a quick try on it. Okay. So, lava waterfalls. There we go. And then we jump onto this. To get up to here. Thruster velocity is inadequate to clear the wall ahead. And we get out here. Okay. Let me in, little piggy. Uh, give me that. How about no? And how about no? That is a very angry VI hybrid thing. This should take the heat off. There we go. Give me the ammo. Nothing else on radar right now. Okay. There we go. And that's those done. That's bypassed a valve. Not entirely sure what that does, but we've done it. It did something. Oh, gives me another way out. Okay. Hello. Hello. Not very happy with me, then I take it. Oh, well. Such is life. Right, so it looks like I have to do... Oh, I see. I see. So you have to do that to increase the vent so you can clear the wall that it said you can't clear. Okay, that makes sense. Basically, we're just giving the, the hammerhead extra lift. That, yeah, all right. Cool. We, that's fine. All right, so then we go back out. And up there, I'm guessing. Yep, there we go. All right, that was nice and easy. Looks like there might be something to loot there. Yep, there is. I was right. Give me this. More iridium. Okay, I'm fine with more iridium. I prefer cash, but, you know. You can't have everything, can you? Right. So... Don't, don't send your butt on the lava. Good lord. There we go. I was cutting that bit fucking fine. Something up there, maybe. Looks like it. Yes, there is. Ha-ha! I'll take this. It looks like there's stuff over here, too. Right. Okay, so we do that. 
Oops, I fucked that. It's also dangerous up there, apparently. Good lord. Then we go here. Oh, shit. Fucking hell, I got shredded in seconds. Ooh, how am I going to deal with those? It's going to be a bit more difficult, isn't it? Oh, i got to do all this again now. Great. I hate the fact you can't save this bloody thing. It's annoying. Fuck off. Now, give me that. And I must remember there's that little sort of hidden one I need to grab. Can I do something incredibly stupid? Yes. There we go. Went better than I expected. I, I can't lie there. Right. Get up here to get the other one. Up we go. I wish I could shoot them from here. That would be great. You can't. But I wish I could. That'll do. Can I get up onto there, maybe? No. Invisible fucking wall bullshit. I can, however, get stuck on basically everything else. Oh, I could get round here, though. Which made that a little bit easier, but not by much. And wait for the fire to go out. I'm trying to work out where I need to go next. I think it's over there. All right, up we go. Oh, fucking hell. Jesus Christ. There's me backing off very, very carefully so I could still get some shots in. It's just like, no, fuck you, you're dead. Jeez. Oh, not... Look, there's nothing there. Get over the stupid non-existing wall. I'm going to get what's up there. Even if it takes me all fucking year. Come on, die, please. There we go. Now I want that. Okay. Now we go back over this way. And it's over here. And boost and jump. And jump again. And jump again. You know what? I'm going for this first. Going up there seems to be good. Yeah, that works better. It's not great. 
because you have to kind of sh uh, shuffle your way up the fucking invisible walls. So it's not fantastic, but it's it's better than just doing head on. Okay, one of them is nearly destroyed. Okay, and then let that calm down again, and then up we go. Get down, get down, get down, get down. Ooh, that's a bit crispy. Done it. Okay. This better be fucking worth it. It's probably going to be more bloody iridium, isn't it? Fucking is. God damn it. God damn it. Okay. Over here. Onto here. Up we go. And grab that last one that's hidden right there. There we go. Right now I need to work out how I'm doing this. I think what I need to do is bunny hop on these. So that one, that one, boost over to here. Crap! Get out the lava, 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 get out the lava. Fucking hell. Jesus. That's going to take the paint off, isn't it? God damn. All targets eliminated. Thanks, Miranda. Right. It's saved. Now I'm going to do a manual save. And I think, given how long we've been doing this because I'm a failure, that's a good place for us to leave this episode. Thank you for watching everyone, I hope you've enjoyed it. Big thanks to the YouTube members and the patrons whose names are on, on screen now as their support has helped keep the channel going and also helped with mod development. Always, always appreciated. Please do the usual, like, subscribe, comment, bell, and hopefully I'll see you for the next one. Cheers.